a cheap, portable quantum computer, aimed at schools and colleges, will be launched later this year. A Chinese startup has unveiled plans to sell a desktop quantum computer costing less than $5,000. The new portable device is one of a range called Spink, aimed at schools and colleges. This is not the company's first quantum computer. Last year, it started selling a desktop quantum computer for around $50,000, but the new machine will be simpler, more portable and cheaper. This simplified version is expected to be released in the fourth quarter of 2021, such that it can be more affordable for most K-12 schools around the world, say the team. The price of the machine is in stark contrast to commercial quantum computers, which can cost in the region of $10 million and process more than 50 quantum bits. By contrast, the Spink machine is much less powerful, able to process just two quantum bits, and relies on an entirely different technology called nuclear magnetic resonance. This works by trapping specially selected molecules in a powerful magnetic field, and then zapping them with radio frequency pulses to manipulate the spins of the atoms they contain. However, if your goal is to acquire this machine, in order to be in possession of the most powerful computer that you have ever had, you will be disappointed. Indeed, with only two quantum bits, none of the algorithms that it can run will not perform better than a conventional computer. For most applications, researchers admit that Gemini does not even come close to a conventional last-generation computer. But the objective here is to demonstrate quantum computing and allow students to try it out themselves. Why is Microsoft making big investments in quantum computing? The short answer is, quantum computing will change everything. Traditional computers represent information in the form of bits, simple ones and zeros. Quantum computers store information in a different way, using quantum bits, or qubits for short. Quantum mechanics allows qubits to store much more complex information than traditional bits, so that each qubit added to the computer doubles its processing power. An exponential gain, not possible with traditional computing. The challenge is that the qubits created so far have proven extremely hard to scale, and small disturbances can throw off the whole operation. So building a computer with today's qubits is like building a tall, narrow tower with blocks. The more you add, the less stable it becomes. Seeing these limitations, Microsoft believes the most promising way to achieve scale is to build a more stable qubit, a topological qubit. To build a topological qubit, we must first master the ability to manipulate a qubit based on a fundamentally different branch of physics. Once achieved, the quicker we can reach our ultimate goal, a quantum computer large and stable enough to solve our most challenging problems. By building the scalable quantum computer, Microsoft will bring revolutionary advances to empower every person and every organization on the planet to achieve more.